Neil Garnham QC will conduct an independent review of all information available to the Council, both information, information that it presently holds and so far as that can be ascertained, information it has previously held, which suggests that during the period 1961 to 1995, sexual or physical abuse of children took place. It may have taken place at premises owned, managed or operated by the Council, which involved pupils or residents under the age of 18 attending establishments funded by the Council, and for which Council officers or employees were responsible, for which councillors were responsible, for which school governors appointed by the Council were responsible. Secondly, Mr Garnham will seek to identify whether there was a pattern to such abuse, whether the abuse of children was tolerated, facilitated or promoted by the Council or its officers or staff, and whether there was a culture at the Council which inhibited the proper investigation, exposure and prevention of such abuse. I would like to appeal for any victims of abuse to come forward. We recognise this is a hugely difficult decision for the people involved, particularly when they involve events many years ago. But we can assure them that we have highly trained officers, but also say that if initially they do not wish to approach the police, they can approach the NSPCC, Children's, Children's Society, Barnardo's, or one of the other support organisations.